The University of Guam Endowment Foundation, along with the Micronesian Chefs Association, bring you the ninth annual Chef's Cup. This year's theme is Mamma Mia, a taste of the Mediterranean. Enjoy a five-course, five-country dinner prepared by Guam's top chefs who will be competing for the coveted Judges Cup and People's Choice Award. For the first course, Pacific Islands Club Executive Chef Ray De Sala will be whipping up Italian appetizers such as tuna carpaccio with roasted baby beets and lemon olive oil, marinated scallops with pureed avocado garlic shrimp bruschetta with pesto and tomato. Chef Peter Duenas from Mescla will be serving up a spicy second course, which is Moroccan spiced pumpkin soup with olive oil poached shrimp and stuffed Moroccan flatbread. Executive sous chef Daniel Lanier from the Western Resort Guam will be plating the third course, which is a hot appetizer from France. Hot smoked lobster served with crab cake and sweet semi-dried tomato fondue. For the fourth course, Churrasco's Brazilian Barbecue's executive chef Michael Moral will be bringing you a touch of Spain with braised beef tenderloin in Rioja sauce. And for the final course, sweet relief from Greece as executive chef Joffrey Paris from Pro Restaurant will be dishing up honey lavender katifi with tangerine gelato, strawberry leather pistachio dust. And now that you know what's on the menu, what about details and how you get into the show? Because guaranteed tickets are going to sell out quick, if not already. Joining me in studio now are the hosts of the annual Chef's Cup competition from the University of Guam Endowment Foundation, Mark Mangiola, and from the Micronesia Chef Association, Peter Duenas. Thank you both for joining us tonight. Half a day, good evening. Half a day. You know, every year there's a theme that goes along with uh, the Chef's Cup. This year it's Mamma Mia. How and who came up with the theme for this year? Well, you know, we have an awesome team of uh, the, the committee. Uh, actually, our chairman, Mr. Jerry Cavill, is our special events chairperson. And um, for the past, I believe, nine years, we've been working with the Night Marketing Group, uh, which is our marketing um, company that we work with, and uh, come up with really awesome themes. And this year, we decided that we wanted to do something that uh, you know, dealt with the Mediterranean. So uh, we, instead of just choosing one country, we actually d decided that five countries, uh, five different uh, uh, items from those countries would be uh, showcased that evening. So uh, the committee decided, uh, we brainstormed, and this is the, it's coming to fruition on February 2nd, so. What countries are gonna be represented? I believe uh, maybe the chef might, uh, Spain, I know is one. We have Spain, we have Greece, Morocco, Spain. we have uh, Italy, we have Greece, and we have, uh, you know, that's, uh, what's the last one? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think it's, uh, you know what? Oh, it's going to be all good food, right? <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. It's a taste of the Mediterranean. It's a taste of the Mediterranean. Well, let's just look at the actual competition, because it's not just uh, professional chefs that are competing, but you guys are getting some help that night. Tell us who are the celebrity uh, guest chefs. Yeah, actually, you know, this, this event's really fun because we're able to uh, engage and, and uh, visit with our folks out there in the uh, business community. And so we uh, sent out notices to about uh, 25 individuals to partner up with the competing chefs. And in addition to that, we also have a junior chef from uh, the Guam Community College that would also be partnering up uh, with the uh, executive chef. So it's going to be an opportunity for them to really uh, learn from the best. I mean, these chefs, I, I've, you know, working in, in this uh, in this job and, and seeing what these chefs do, uh, it's really amazing. And we we're fortunate enough that uh, these business community folks, some um, leaders in the industry, the banking industry, of, of course, we got uh, also from the real estate industry. Uh, so it's going to be uh, really uh, interesting to see these folks let their guards down, so to speak, and to really have fun <laughs> with, uh, have fun that evening. There's got to be some rivalry going on. Oh, there's a lot of smack talking <laughs> and all that. You know, I mean, in, in the in the culinary industry, it's a very competitive industry, mm -hmm. and we're always about competition, and you know, and we we all individually strive to do our best to 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 you know to show off mm -hmm. show off what we're all about, and and uh, this is a night that definitely will will set the set the theme for for anybody who's attending. There's I mean, I've been a part of a series of videos and mm -hmm. skits, and um, there's even karaoke. Yeah. Karaoke, it's a it's a kind of like a karaoke theme yeah. where people can sing along with the songs that are being played. Yeah. 
Yeah, um, because it's not just about the food. There's lots yes. of entertainment. Oh, it's, it's uh, hilarious. The entertainment coming out of, alone. Yeah, yes. coming out of Mamma Mia, uh, the Mamma Mia movie. So it's kind of a spinoff of that and where the folks get to uh, per perform and do some of the songs that were uh, in that, that uh, show. So we're really excited about that. And of course, the chefs, uh, I, I must say, when talk about rivalry, just to see these guys <laughs> all together as a group, but they're the most mm -hmm. professional people I've ever worked with. And uh, you know, I'm just pleased that uh, we were able to partner up with uh, the Micronesian Chefs Association. Association, of course, the president here, Mr. Duane, and uh, the Endowment Foundation. This has been a, a relationship for nine years, and mm -hmm. next year will be our 10th anniversary, so mm -hmm. we're really looking forward to that. Time <laughs> flies when you're having fun. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> now, I understand um, you were mentioning there's going to be entertainment outside from people karaoke, but there's actually going to be some professional entertainment. Yeah, we have some, uh, we have a really, uh, you know, really interesting uh, performance that's going to be there uh, that evening. We had a, a partnership with Patrick Palomo, or one of our, you know, he's awesome musician and a leader on the island when it comes to music and he's been able to partner up with a uh, a tar player from the Persian region so uh, it's beautiful when they they play together we had an opportunity to listen to them uh, do a little uh, performance for uh, the committee and we were just really impressed with the the, mu the entertainment that that they're going to be able to provide that evening okay when where what time is the event and are are there any tickets left uh we are our show uh the, the it's february 2nd that's a wednesday so in the middle of the week we're going to be having some fun <laughs> uh, it's going to be at the hyatt hotel and uh the doors uh actually the cocktail there's going to be a cocktail uh, portion of it at 5 30 and then the doors open at 6 30 and uh, rest assured once the food and the uh, activities start flowing it's gonna it's gonna be a wonderful evening and we're just excited and this is all gonna benefit of course the Yoji Endowment Foundation and uh, with that I uh, also have to say with because of our partnership uh, it's also gonna provide uh, some scholarship opportunities for the uh, chefs at the Guam Community College so this event really I think uh, when Mr. Calvo uh, did, you know came up with the concept was to really engage the community to come together for uh, education higher ed whether it be GCC or UOG and the University of Guam Endowment Foundation serves to support programs and, and uh, services and activities at the University of Guam. So this event, uh, you know, has been a staple event for the Endowment Foundation. We're excited to do it again. Okay, final comments, Peter? Come out and enjoy a night of entertainment, great food. You definitely won't be sorry. Yeah. And I must say,